After the summer, three months of summer, you got to see something uh, vibrating. People are like dancing, walking all along. It feels good. It makes, com makes, makes the campus more beautiful. The energy is high on the University of Alabama's campus. Students are a week away from the official start of their fall semester. As WBTM 13's Gladys Batista explains, the school's president is looking ahead to the future of the growing university. Momentum is building on the University of Alabama's campus, with the student body just one week away from the start of the 2023 semester. It's this Alabama experience that they want to be a part of, and I do not see it subsiding. Coming off of a year of record enrollment with 38,000 students and the largest freshman class ever, University of Alabama President Dr. Stuart Bell expects this year's numbers to be even higher. The undergraduate level, um, we're reaching uh, we're reaching a capacity number, and understand when you talk about the demand. So as of today, I had about 58,400 applications for the freshman class. The growing student population is behind many of the efforts taken within the year to improve the campus. University Boulevard, open to traffic again within the last week, was a part of that. But we have 29 projects that we're finishing this summer to make sure that we're accommodating those students. And even as our numbers grow of enrolled students, um, we've also had a concerted effort to keep our classes small. But Bell also acknowledges the improvements that came through more difficult experiences. In January, Tide basketball player Darius Miles was arrested for murder for his alleged role in the shooting death of young mother Jamia Harris on the Tuscaloosa Strip. Then in May, a documentary unauthorized by the school showcased the emotional toll of the university's sorority rush period. If you take a look at any of those things that happened, we um, we reacted very quickly, made changes uh, to how we address safety on our campus where we have uh, put in a, a separate precinct on uh, in the strip area. We've hired uh, a significant number of new safety officers to make sure that we have great visibility. We've improved the feeling, the environment um, on our campus. Something Bell hopes to build on. As great of a university as we are, as great of success as we've had, we will be better next year. In Tuscaloosa, Gladys Bautista, WVTM 13. Dr. Bell became the 29th president of the University of Alabama in June of 2015. He previously served as a faculty member and department head of mechanical engineering. Classes begin a week from today.